Okay, let's have a look at an app called Visual Multiplication Table. And uh, this is by iDev Books that have made um, some uh, fantastic uh, math apps over the last two years. So definitely check out their site, iDevBooks.com. Um, when we open this up, we're on the settings page and we can have uh, different things. Tables can be in uh, you know, 1 to 10 or 1 to 12. We're going to leave it on 1 to 12 for the demonstration. The theme can be black or white. We'll leave it on white. And the main screen can be moving or static. Now, if I put it on moving, you'll see the dots in the background start to move. You can change the animation if you want to. But when we click done, it's just a cool effect uh, of them moving around. If I go back in and put that on static and click done, you'll see they're all in one group. So we'll leave it like that for the demo. So let's start by looking at uh, multiples. When you click on this, um, you get uh, all of the... Um, numbers, the 12 times table, so you've got 1 to 144 and the cool thing about this is if you click on the number 2 it'll show you all the multiples of 2. You just click on it again to delete, click on the number 3, it'll show you all the multiples of 3, click on the number 4, show you all the multiples of 4 and so on and of course you can have different ones on if you want, so all multiples of 4, 5 and 6 um, and so on. So let's go back out that's also another way to look at it um, before we do go back out. It just shows you, um, if you turn off the 5 and the 6, those are all the multiples of 4. Um, and that goes back to the other way. So go back out to the home page and let's look at groups. Now this is really cool um, because if you click a number, so let's say 42 for example, it tells you all the ways to get to 42 within the multiplication table. So 1 times 42, 2 times 21, 14 times 3 and so on and so forth but what is really neat is if you do this with the table and then you click up here it separates it all for you and then if you click on one of these you'll see 1 times 56 is what's showing then 2 times 28 it splits it up 4 times 14 7 times 8 and then 8 times 7 so it breaks it down visually for you to see and then you can go back to the main page and you can see with different ones you get lots of different um, different possibilities so that's a lot of fun to play with and you can see it broken down into different ways which is really neat and I really like this because of the visual effects um, and the way the kids get to do it and again it becomes um, more fun than anything else when they're going into this let's look at solve and what you get here these are all your answers to, you know, 6 times 6 is 36 and so on, and 10 times 10 is 100. When you click this button, they get all jumbled up. And then you have to basically drag the dots into the correct position. So 80, for example, would be 8 times 10, and it would fall there. Um, 110 would be 11 times 10. I'm doing really easy ones here. Uh, 2 times 2 would be 4. Um, let's see... Let's see, 6 times 6 would be 36, and so on. And you go through that until you complete all of the tables. And you'll find that once you've, you take the time to do this, um, the whole thing will fill in. But it's a really good exercise. It's actually great for adults, too, to, to uh, um, give your brain some exercise. And that shows you where all of the dots go if you have any issues. Going back out, look at the table itself. Um, this is just a simple way of looking at the 12 times table and don't forget you can look at it at 10 times table if you want to but wherever you click you've got the visual uh, of what these are when you touch them it shows you the 6 times 9 so you've got 6 times 9 you've got 9 times 6 and so on it shows you how it breaks it down how it gets to that number okay so it's really cool um, have a look it's um, it's a great app, uh, really nicely put together, works really, really well, and it's by iDevBooks. It is called Visual Multiplication Table.